Hi there, Toy here, and I'm doing a two for one. So first, I'm going to record an update, kind of wrap up video for what I read in April. I didn't do this in March because I was trying some new things, seeing how they were going to go, and I think I like where they're going. So this is going to be a relatively short video. The follow-up video that I'm going to record right after this will be my review video, and it's going to be a lot longer. <laughs> so let's just look at um, what I have going on in terms of my Goodreads challenge, my audiobook challenge, and da 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 <laughs> So I'll let you know right now my audiobook challenge is non-existent. I've completed one audiobook this year, and it's already May. My second audiobook was a dud, and I just haven't been able to get back onto the audiobook kick. I went on vacation last week thinking that would be a great time to do it, only I forgot to download the book before I left, and then once I got to where I was, of course there was no service for me to download the audiobook. We'll see what happens. But let's see how I'm doing on my Goodreads challenge. Let's see here. I'll pull some stuff up. Here we go. So I am currently nine books ahead on my Goodreads challenge, which is great. Um, I do always like to remind you to clarify that when I set up my challenges, they're based on the number of titles I read. That doesn't mean that everything that I read is a novel and book. I read um, novels, I read graphic novels, I read picture books, I read short stories. So these are just the titles that I've read so far. Um, you can see on this page some of the things that I want to read. And let's look at what I'm currently reading. I got a cozy mystery, an anthology, and a kind of a horror mystery coming up. Um, I did complete one book in the month of May already, which is How to Publish and Promote Your Book. You can see it's a five star, but I'll get into that more later. Um, I'm going to real quickly just go through the books that I read in April. High Mountains of Portugal. And we're loading, loading, loading. <laughs> These are the books that I'm going to be doing the reviews for. Carol of Ghosts. Let's see what's next. Teen Titans Beast Boy. The Disaster Curse. Blank Space. Deep Point of View. And After the Rain. So I read quite a bit of stuff in the month of um, April, and so that's why I'm, you know, doing the wrap-up and then doing a separate review video for that. And um, I also launched a new newsletter where I list all my reviews and um, just kind of talk about my love and joy of reading. So if you're interested in that, please check it out. And I'm trying to think, you've seen what I'm currently reading not going to talk about what I plan to read because whenever I plan something, it seems to never happen. I am going to try to pick back up with my audiobook challenge, but we'll see what happens. So um, that is what I read in April, what I'm currently reading in May. And uh, yeah, so let me know what you guys have going on. And if you want, stick around for the review video that is coming. Bye for now.